Oh my God, I love Tom Slaughter's work. We're gonna show Tom Slaughter here? Yep. We are? Well, he doesn't know yet, but. He, he doesn't know it yet? No, I mean, I gotta go see him, but I mean, wh why wouldn't he, right? He, he hasn't had a show in New York in a while, and I mean. Well, how, how are you going to convince him to do a show with us? I mean, there's so many galleries, and he's such, you know, he's great. I know. Well, I'm gonna go see him, and I'm gonna, uh, you know, share my extensive art world knowledge with him. A, B, I'll charm him. You're gonna char charm him, okay? And um, what about charm what about highway? what is it? It's a C. What? You said A B. That's not a. C. Ow! Ow! You're so a little fragile, aren't you? Ow! Sorry. This is a, that's a C. Well, okay. C. Whatever you said, A B C. What's the C? C. I'm gonna see him. You're gonna see him. Yeah. I got A and B. Yeah, I was thinking you need D, E, and F. Sounds like a real boondoggle. Don't even go there, okay? It's going to be a bonanza, is what it's going to be. A bonanza? You remember Little Horse and... Remember dum da da dum da da dum da da dum da da dum bum That's it. dum da da dum da dum da dum da dum da dum da dum Tom Slaughter. I'm sorry, the shrink's office is next door. No, Tom, Jim Kepner. Oh, Jim. Jim. Jim, come on in. Hey. Nice to see you. How are, good to see you. Nice place. Thank you. Wow. Whoa. Who are these people? Yeah, this is a uh, wall of all my friends and whatnot who have visited the studio over the years. Yeah? Yeah, I'm sure you'll recognize some wow. of the people. For instance. Don't yeah. tell me. Don't tell me. I know. Uh, the movie with all the kids hanging out, the, the clerks? It's not that one, Jim. This is Adam Weinberg, the director of the Whitney Museum. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I know Adam very well. Adam, the beard, kind of. Yeah, he, he always has a beard, Jim. But not, yeah. What about this fellow? Let me, this one is Hair Club for Men? No, Jim, that's... Glenn Lowry, the director of the Museum of Modern Art, mean anything to you? Yeah. Oh, I didn't... That was an old picture, huh? Yeah, it must be an old picture. No, I know, Glenn... Yeah, I was talking to him the other day, um, actually. So... Oh, is that Demi Moore? That's Demi Moore, Jim. Dummy? No, no, Jim. Demi. That's how she pronounces it. Duh. Me. <laughs> Duh is right. Who's that uh, sweet little vixen? Huh? Yeah, Jim. That sweet little vixen, that's my daughter. That's my daughter, Hannah. She's uh, adorable. Yeah, that's cute. Thanks, Jim. What a fantastic space. And the work? speaks for itself. I mean, I was getting to the work. The work is... Did you, know, you see this piece here, Jim? The red paint? I didn't know you were like a symbolist. What is this? I'm sorry, what does that symbolize? You see it says red. Yes. And most of the word... Pain. Pain. Oh. Because the artist, you know. Oh. That, that's really, that's good. Incredible. Thank it, you. Toothbrushes? Yes, that's good, Jim. You, you recognize those as toothbrushes. It's like toothbrushes, but not. And that's what I love the work. Yeah, it's a metaphor, Jim. Yeah. That's a, metaf that's a metaphor, obviously, for... It's a metaphor for a relationship. Oh, I got it. It's like... Between two, you know, it's like an artist, art dealer, that kind of symb symbiosis. Not that kind of a relationship. It's like two lovers, let's say. Tom, let's not go there. Because I would never... I wouldn't put my toothbrush with anybody's toothbrush. Would you... You have... Germ issues? Whatever, who doesn't? 
No? Okay. That looks like an apple. It's just like... That symbolizes an apple. By being an apple. That is an apple? Yeah, go right ahead. Help yourself. Yeah. Here, here, let me... Go right ahead. Thanks. I'm going to eat it in a, a little bit. Thank you. Oh, what's that? That's a David Hockney. This is a David Hockney. I, could, I know. For Tom, you uh, know, I got to tell you, I've got somebody right now, Drew, I, would, you, if, would you mind if, if we whited that out? Would that bother you? Because honestly, if it says Tom, nobody's going to buy it, Tom. I, I'm hearing you, but I'm not believing you. This is a treasure for Tom, love David H. Read not for sale. Uh, the love is great. I mean, I love the love part. Thank you. Okay. Let's just move what on. What is it? Well, you know, that's a Keith Haring. Well, yeah. Keith and I. That's not a. Yeah, he gave that to me in 19, I don't know, 83. I've dealt with a lot of Keith Haring's. That. That's the crawling baby. That's an iconic Keith crawling Haring. Crawling baby? Yes. What happened to the head? It got yeah, shot it off. It got slightly damaged. Uh, what's that? Oh, the flip flops. Yeah, you like the flip flops? Love the flip flops. Love, love, love the flip flops. The flip flops are another metaphor, Jim. I knew that. That's for a relationship. Like an artist, art dealer. No, Jim. The flip-flops are a metaphor for the summer, for fun, for... Forget it. Let's okay. just move on. Do you remember? Did you see Anything Goes? The musical? Friendship, friendship. It's the only bland ship. When other peoples have been forgot, shh, 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 ours will still be not. No, I didn't see that. Okay, you're lucky. Jim, let's talk about the deal. The deal? The deal. The signing bonus. Signing bonus. Yeah, you know, like Damien Hurst allegedly got a million dollars when he signed with Gagosian. Allegedly. Well, Jim, you got to sweeten it a little bit. What is that, like an advance on sales? No, it's not an advance on sales. This is a way of you saying, Tom, I love you. Tom, I love you. Yeah, but you got to say it in a different way. Okay. Uh, I mean, how about I take you to lunch? Every day? Once a month. Twice a week at Balthazar's. Once a week, the Chelsea Diner, anything you want off the menu, lunch menu, and, and, uh, and I'll bring a sandwich from home. I mean, if that... But, I mean, Tom, this is about... Do you want to show in one of the best galleries in Chelsea? Yes, but I'll still consider showing with you, Jim. Look, I have to sell myself? A little, yes. Really? Really? I mean... Ask around, Tom. Ask around. Let's cut to the chase, Jim. Ask around. Jim, enough. Let me explain it to you. You have family, friends, lawyers, crack dealers, art dealers. What about Hans Scum? Jim, did you do the Armory Show this year? I we won. don't need the Armory Show. We have an Armory Show every day at the gallery, right. every day. I hope so, because yeah. you're not going to have a career in football. Jim, I've had 21-man shows. I'm in collections all over New York. Do you know my prints are at the Whitney Museum of American Art? Really? You think there's anything you could do to help me? Tom? Keep the left arm straight. Good shot. What is that? Is that a, is that a coffee cup? A cup of coffee? Yes. Jim See, that? I knew it. Looks just like it's, it's. I love your stuff. You know that. Yes, Jim. Okay. But I think this is the time you take it to the extra, extra level. To Jim Kepner Gallery. Yeah, I have a contract, actually. Oh, you have a contract. I do have a contract. Very simple. I've got it right off the internet. And, and your own pen and everything. Yeah, I happen to have a pen. And, um, it's, and I mean, the, fu the funny thing is it's like I don't really even want it, but... Let me have a look. Yeah, okay. Jim, 
artist responsible for, for shipping, you cannot be serious. Jim. Is that a problem? That's a deal breaker. Okay, deal, deal breaker? Done. Done. There you go. Jim, right after that it says, the artist shall be responsible for all the art. You mean insurance-wise? Insurance. You have insurance. Yes, I have insurance when the material is here. When it leaves, then it's you. Please. Is that a problem? That'll be a problem. Is that a problem? Not a problem. Thanks. Okay, done. Insurance. That's why you have insurance. Right? Initial it, and there you go. Please, thanks. Other than that, I think it's simple. It's everything is straightforward. What? This last uh, paragraph yeah. three, section seven. Sixty forty. Uh, that's a typo. It's not dealer sixty, artist forty. It's artist sixty, dealer forty. That's a ty that, yeah. That's a typo. It should be that's artist a typo. That's sixty. A I understand. Can I see that? That's oh yeah, typo. Should be fifty fifty. Sixty forty, Jim. 55, 60, 40. 60, 40. Artist, 60, dealer, 40. 60, 40 it is. You just initial that, please. I, okay. Thank you very much. Will you sign it? We have an agreement. We're agreed to tentatively agree to discuss this at a later date. Huh? We have a tentative agreement to agree. Let's make a deal. So you'll have your lawyer look at it. I'll, I'll have my lawyer look at it. Let's, Let's make a deal. John? John, maybe. Yes, darling. The water's getting cold. You're really going to have to come now. Yeah, y yes, darling. I'll be right there. I'll be right there. Jim, you got to go now. I'll be right there. I'll see you later. Great to okay, see you. Okay, Tom. So long. Oh, Bye for now. Very nice. Oh. Thank you, Jim. Bye for now. Okay. Lovely to see you. Tom? Yeah. It's lovely. Terrific. Lovely. I'll be right there.